Hi, Taman and Jackie. Well, one man was pronounced dead at the scene while three others were rushed to the hospital. At this time, we don't know the extent of their injuries, but witnesses we heard from describe the scene as horrific chaos. On Sunday morning, Chicago police say three people were hurt and a 57 year old man was killed when this red car plowed into a bus shelter. It happened on 79th Street and Martin Luther King Jr. Drive. Th these people got to live. They got to go home to their loved ones, not be laying up in a cemetery or somebody's funeral home. Sean Caples was looking out his apartment window when he noticed things suddenly go wrong. I seen the car go off on the side. And then it hurried up and ran up on the sidewalk and it hit the, the bus uh, uh, detour thing right there and knocked it on the people. And I said, they ain't even have enough time to move. It happened so fast. Capel says the people who were hit were pinned down. The other three, their legs was caught up under the pole and one leg was up under the uh, tire of the car. The bus shelter was destroyed with its roof lying on the sidewalk and broken glass everywhere. CPD says two women, a 23 and a 64 year old, plus another man, were taken to the University of Chicago Hospital with unknown injuries. Witnesses say the scene left them speechless. I was pulling up, so then next thing you know, it's just like boom. Police took someone into custody, but the crash has sparked worry in the minds of some, and they're asking drivers to be more alert on the road. So people just got to be careful when they drive and make sure you call shit or whatever. It's not clear what caused the driver to veer off the road. It's also unknown whether drugs or alcohol played a factor, but police say charges are pending. We are live at UFC Hospital. Andrea Medina, WGN News.